Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Lukezilla! I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Lukezilla! Oh! What's poppin' YouTube world? Lukezilla here, joined by the Gaming Jess. We're back on the iCraft server. Yep. Yep. <laughs> All right, so today, Jess and I have a project that we're going to work on. Do you want to fill the viewers in on what we're going to be doing? All right, so we're going to make a sheep farm, but we're going to have colorful sheep in it. Yeah, we're going to have a uh, multicolored farm. It's going to have all, uh, however many sheep colors there are. I still forgot to look that up. I think it's 18. Okay, something like that. <laughs> anyway, so... Uh, this is the plot that we have for it. We kind of flattened out some area, and this is going to be the middle of it where the doorway is going to be. So I'm thinking to start, I'm going mm. to put this cobblestone here out front because this is going to be like the front of the building. And then we have the, uh, these dirt blocks here to mark out the corners. Mm -hmm. Um. So we don't really have a design like planned out, so I guess we're just gonna kind of play it by ear and see how things go. So I was thinking for one part of it, I want to have like a little uh, part right here that like extrudes out for like the front door. I don't want it to j like just walk up to it, so. Yeah. Maybe if we had it like almost domey, would that work? Yeah, that'd be cool. All right, so I'm thinking, you think four, four, uh, four, I can't talk. Do you think four blocks is enough? Yeah. All right, then this can be like where the actual building starts. Mm -hmm. All right, so here's the blocks that I have on me. Um, we want to try to incorporate a lot of uh, birch wood because there's not much of that around here. So we figured we'd try to use it to lighten the place up a bit. So, i got yeah. some planks here, and let's let's just try to make like a little front entrance. Actually, I don't know what this is going to look like. Let me try something out real quick. You can experiment too. Yeah. I don't have any blocks on me. I'm thinking... Thank you. I have some birch ones too. Oh, planks? Okay. Actually, no, never mind. I've got some. Oops. Okay. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so... An I'm thinking just, like, around here. And I hear those zombies again. <laughs> so we had a... like a There's, like, a bunch of zombies that like to hide underground. And they're really hard to find. And they make a bunch of noise every time we come around this area. Alright, so I'm thinking if we do something like that, uh, I have a crafting table, so let's yeah. throw that down real quick. Um, I want to make some, some cobblestone stairs. I'm just experimenting with some ideas. So. Alright. I'm thinking if we use uh, cobblestone stairs to go around the outside, that would look pretty cool. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Like I said, uh, we're just going to be kind of playing this by ear. Wait, I have an idea. Do you? Yes. Okay. Uh, Oops. Oh, My Jess, you're breaking everything. Strong. <laughs> the lag and the pickaxe are not a good combination. Ooh, You're like, pretty. I know, does that work? Yeah. I was, I was thinking we could do, um, let's see, I need to make some more planks. I was thinking since this is just like the little entranceway part, we'd probably have more like a little just cobblestone Oop. more cobblestone yep. yeah more cobblestone pillars just right there i see him <laughs> bugger's trying to sneak up on me wearing his pajamas is it just me or does a uh, leather armor look like pajamas on zombies does it that 
Right, so I'm thinking we could do. I don't know, maybe leave that open as like a window. I think we put like glass panes in it. That might mm -hmm. look cool. We could put like colored glass panes. Yeah, I was thinking like maybe like white or. I don't know. And let's see. Up there, we could go. Okay, Ooh. we could do that. I don't know. I'm just kind of winging it. If we don't like it, we can change it. it. I don't know. That doesn't look too bad, though. What no. do you think? Yeah, it looks fine. No, I'm not a master builder, so I don't <laughs> quite know what I'm doing. I'm not the best either. I'm just alright. You're better than me. I'm just alright. What you think this is? A zombie party? Ooh, he gave me some pants. I already got some pants. But I'll combine them with my pants make them even better pants. There we go. Now I'm looking good, eh? Nice. Oh, you lost your enchantment on your pants. That's alright. It wasn't important. It was just a mob drop anyway. Yeah, yeah. Oh, need more stairs. Don't worry, I got some. Oops. <laughs> Looks like you're having a little trouble there. Mm hmm. Keep Actually, going. I kind of like that. Hold on. What if we, uh,. Do that. And there's like that little circle yep. there. I kind of like that. That looks uh -huh. interesting. Having problems of stairs. They won't do what I want them to. <laughs> Where's this going to go? Alright, Jess, how do you... How, um, what do you... Oh, wow, I cannot talk today. Sorry, what, I'm just experimenting. <laughs> uh... How about we uh, take a little cut real quick, work on this a bit more, and then come back? Yep. All right, guys, we'll be back. All right, so we're back. This is what we have done so far. And, yeah, I think it's coming along pretty well. This entranceway with the, um, we have some hardened clay inside of there, which, um, it's, like, so different from the rest of the blocks. It really stands out. Um, we're going to have to, like, work on the inside of here. But uh, we weren't really working on the inside. We're mainly um, paying attention to the outside. So I think uh, just by the outside so far, it's turning. It's it's starting to look really really good. I don't know. I like yep. it. So there's still a lot more work to be done, and mm -hmm. Jess and I will continue working on that, and we will cut back in once again when we have a little bit more progress done. So we'll be back. Alright guys, we're back again. Jess and I have been working. We have the uh, the structure all the way finished. We decided that since there are 16 different color wool, we're going to have um, four pens on each side, and then we're going to have a lower level um, that has four pens on each side down there as well. So basically what we did was we uh, mapped out the size of this place and we filled in the walls. Um, for now, we just did them... Uh, just simply, like, we have the cobble and we have the birch. Now we're going to um, add some details to the wall like we have on the front with the uh, the stairs. But we'll probably do uh, more than just that, of course, because, no, why just do that? So we're going to get cracking on that and we'll be back again. So, yeah. yeah. All right, guys. So the gaming just had to vanish, but here I am and I'm going to be... Uh, continuing on my own <laughs> uh so I, I try i'm trying out this uh rim of uh jungle i think it looks really good so i do have some jungle saplings and just dropped off her stuff here but i i really like the way the uh jungle wood looks crap <laughs> ran out of space um all right so i just made a bunch of those that'll work for now and then i'll turn the rest of these into planks and then Bam. I want these to go all the way around the outside of the place. Yeah, we're uh, we're getting really close to other buildings. Like, this is almost rubbing nipples with Nexus's place. And then, 
I don't know. This thing still has a little bit of work to do. Like, it's coming along. Don't worry. It's getting there. But it's just going to take a little bit. And I'll show you it from the inside. It's not too spectacular. Like, I don't know. It's going to have a lot more work done to it. So I'm going to work on it. And I will be back. Okay, now I think it's time to work on the roof. So... I finished filling in the jungle wood all the way around. Alright, so let me show you something from the inside. I was planning on filling uh, that part in with birch wood to match that, but I kind of like the way the jungle looks. So I think I might keep that. Also, I added uh, this little bit just for a little bit of aesthetics. aesthetics. Um, I'm going to try something else as well. Putting those at the angle. Uh... I changed my mind. <laughs> I don't like that. What if I put them at this angle? Um, no. Come on, I gotta think of something to do with them. I just, I just feel like they don't look very good like that. Well, I don't know. Then what if I do that? And no. How about no? That's not working for me. Um, I don't know. I'll play with that another time. Got other things to play with right now. Okay, so I'm just gonna block my way up here. So what I'm thinking for the roof, I want it to be like so this is this is one block up. This one's gonna be two, three, and a half. Then this one's going to be um, if I can place this block, that's not going to work. Um, I, w I just want it to be like that, and <laughs> I was just making this a lot more difficult on myself. I don't know what's going to be inside here. I don't think it's going to be like all cobblestone, so one, two, and a half. Did I place that half block? Yeah. And then the next one's going to be a one and a half, which is just going to be like a full block. I kind of want most of these to be on the uh, the half slab level so that they're not spawning mobs. Whoa, that looks way higher of a gradient than I wanted. I kind of just want it to be like, uh, I don't know. I'm going to play around with things, and I'll cut back. Alright, so I have to say, from the front, this is looking... Oh, snap, that scared the crap out of me. Zombie, what do you think this is? Whew! I don't know why that scared me, that just gave me goosebumps. Alright, so, yeah, this is coming along really well so far. I like how that turned out, it looks really good. So, what's left is to... <laughs> finish the roof coat across the uh, the rest of the building. I don't know if I'm gonna make another window like this in the back. I think I need to make two more of those things. Let's see, there are four blocks in between these. So let's just go out um, one, two, three, four. So another one here. And then again, one, two, three, four. So next one here, just because this wall is looking a little boring, so so cobble up there, come around the outside, block, uh, block, block, more blocks, block, 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 block. Alright, so I feel like since these are like poking out like this, I feel like there needs to be something on top of there, but I don't know. I kind of like how there is not anything on top of there at the same time. Maybe I was thinking, okay, I don't have any on me. I was thinking I could throw up like a cobblestone wall or something, but I'm not so sure about that. Um, also, if you notice in the uh, the corners that I did over here, I um, have a cobblestone there with a cobblestone wall going up with some stairs there because I thought it was weird how um, those pillars just like came up and stopped. So I was like, well, I'll throw stairs on top. Then whenever I put stairs on things, I made a corner stair to go in between them. And I was like, well, maybe I should connect this to the ground. So that's what 
came out and I really like it. So here's it from the front. I'm going to uh, continue the roof and then I'll be back in a bit. Alrighty guys, so we have the roof finished all the way around now. I decided to add a window there and I also put in a skylight here that I'm going to uh, fill with glass um, whenever the time comes, whenever I do that. Let me just uh, double check the roof. Huh, there's a little bit of cobble that's there that I didn't fill all the way through. Maybe I ought to do that. I guess I didn't really think that one through. Oh, great. <laughs> that's going to be fun. I'm going to have to pillar up and down, and I'll, I'll do that in a bit. All right, so I think the exterior might be all the way complete. Let me uh, show you all one thing. I was talking about what can go up on top of here is I did end up putting... Yeah, the cobblestone walls to see how it looks and I like I like the look of it I think it looks pretty cool so yeah we got that going on um the sides still look kind of I don't know I don't want to say bland but I feel like I feel like we could do a little bit more with them just to make them stand out a bit let's see if we have let's make a couple more of these do that to make just just a few more just for testing purposes so like up here we have that little pattern thing going on what if um like we don't do it on like the front or the back but what if like just for the sides we go around and we do that see that doesn't look too bad Um, I don't think we should do it to the back. The back has a lot of detail because that's up there as well. Let's skip the back. Let me... Is this even? Yeah. Alright, I was just making sure I did it right. It looked a little off for some reason. Don't know why. I guess it was just the angle I was looking. But, don't worry. It's all goo. It's all goo. <laughs> I'd say it's all good. Good, good, good. Jeez, I am struggling speaking today. Must... Eh... It wasn't even like that long of a day. I mean, it kind of was. I had school, then I had work. By school, I mean like college, because I'm in college. Not like, sc not like school, but like classes. I don't know. It's whatever. All right. Yeah. So this is looking very good. So now it's time to finally start on the interior. So I'll work on that, and then yeah, I'll be back in a bit. That looks really weird when it rains. Okay, another quick little update. Um, we have a skeleton dancing around on the roof. I got blown up by a creeper twice while working on this. It kind of sucks. One time I died, the other time I just almost died. Just because it's like, you know, I was in there, I was placing down some fences, and the freaking th the freaking thing just like snuck up on me out of nowhere. It's like, I don't know where the heck it came from. Yeah, but, uh, this is what I have so far. So, originally, we did not want there to be two floors, but since there's 16 different types, there wasn't any way we were going to fit eight little, um, cages, not cages, eight little pens, like, going all the way down. We would interfere with other people's things, so we decided we'd make four here, four there, and then there'd be a downstairs, and there will be four on that side and four on that side once I finish all that so um I like I think I am going to leave this all grass I think down here I'm going to put um oak wood slabs on the underneath of that so it looks like there's actually support to it but up uh, downstairs is going to be like it's all its own little room all together um, this is what I went on for, like, the little opening, because I thought I was using way too much cobblestone, so I, um, I changed it to that instead, and that looks really good. So, all in all, this building is, oh man, I got hiccups. <sighs> I had to take a deep breath and make it go away. All in all, this building is coming out really good. I still need to put in the, um, the glass for the roof there, and I need to, um, put in the, uh, glass panes right here. But, other than that, and the basement, of course, um, and moving the sheep in, this is, um, you know, coming pretty close to being done. But I think I am going to 
end off this episode where we are here because um, I have a lot of area to clear out and yeah, a lot of work has already gone into the episode thus far. So the rest I will do off camera and show off in my next episode. So as always, thank ooh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a good night, day, morning, evening, whatever it is for you. Have a great one. I will catch you next time. See you guys. I know I said the episode was over, but it's not because I have something to show you. But, oh, <laughs> except if it didn't render in. All right, so I did go ahead and finish this up off camera, inside and all. So uh, first, let's just uh, look at it from the outside. Oh, crap, there actually is something that I didn't finish, but it's just a small thing. All right, so here's a look at it from the outside. You've already seen that. Uh, I feel weird playing without that. You've already seen that. Let me pull my pants back on. Here's it from the outside. You go inside and... Well, bam, I have some signs here that say sheep for shearing, not for breeding. Anyway, there needs to be glass panes here, and uh, I need to fill in the, uh, the sunroof or <laughs> the whatever it's called. So, yeah, that's all that needs to be done. Other than that, we have a sheep in the first pen. I'm going to uh, breed up the numbers. I think I'm going to put eight in each pen, and then we have those there. So, I don't know, you come inside, and there's like this... The balcony uh, leaning over the uh, the downstairs place, and the downstairs looks like this. Pretty pretty similar to the top bit. I use a lot of the same colors. The stairway here. Um, I just made like a little design thing on the walls. I think it looks all right. And then I have like the dirt supported by these um, oak plank or oak half slabs, which I think looks really cool. Um, I like how I'm using a different color fence than fence gate because it makes the fence gate stand out more. I did that on purpose. Like I tried with a uh, with birch fence gates. I don't have any on me. I think I threw them away. So I tried them with birch, but those ones um, I don't know. I just felt like they didn't stand out enough, and it was kind of hard to see where the fence gate was exactly. So I changed the color to use like a different color fence gate, and I like the way this looks. So anyway, guys, I hope you like this too. Make sure to have a good night, day, morning, evening, whatever it is for you. Have a great one. I will catch you next time. See you guys.